Hey, what's up, y'all? It's your two real guy, Jay Black, here with another episode of my Life Feet Basic Tutorial, and with episode two. In this episode, we're going over the lock in, man. So, get ready, get right, let's go. All right, guys, so lock in is the way of how we finish our moves in the Life Feet Dance style, all right? So, you're doing your thing, mix it up, man, different moves, right? After you hit your rep up, then you about to get to the finisher, and it's pop, pop. So, it don't matter about anything else that you're doing before. Just this open and close motion is what we consider our locking. So, you don't have to specifically just do it like the regular one. You can mix it up. You can boom with the elbow. You can boom. You can boom. It don't matter how you switch it up and add it. Give it style to it. As long as you give it that explosive ending, you feel me? That is what we consider in the life you coach it. The lock, you know, so we teach you how the basic one. So like I said, it's the open. You see, as I reach my arms up, my legs also stretch out. So it's one, two. I'll show you how from the side. It's one. It's the finisher totals, your moves, right? So you know, life feet and dancing, that's like physical expression, right? So your rev up. Like I told you on episode one, if you haven't checked that out, make sure that you go check that out, make sure that you go subscribe, I like that one, right? So, episode one, rev up, right? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. In between the rev up to the lock in, it's just freestyle of your own flavor, your own mood, right? You're mixing it up, you're doing your own thing, right? But since, like I said, dancing is like your physical expression, describing on how you feel or you describing the beat or you doing musicality or wordplay, right? So you mixing your moves up, like for example, right? So it's like, oh, lean back then, but two, three, one, and one, two, 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 bop, 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 it up, boom. That's considering me finishing that move, right? So a lot of people ask me, how do I know when to lock it? You feel it within yourself. Like life beat is open. Full count from the rev up, and you can blend it into an eight count depending on if you doing a fake out with your lock in. So with the lock in, right? Which is your finisher. Now a lot of people fake out, which is basically them faking as if they're about to lock in and they end up actually rebuilding it to another move just so they can be able to transition and rebuild the move to be even more explosive because the whole goal is for you to lock in and make sure that it's like explosive you lock in you want them to feel it like that's you like mm, like i just killed this i just killed this that's the vibe you want to get like i just killed this so when you finish a move sometimes you can blend your move just to do fake outs or Just for you to rebuild the move up just to be even more explosive. So, hope you guys enjoyed that one. Uh, comment below if you got any questions. Stay tuned for the next tutorial. We're going crazy.